right, so we're at this target now, and the four packs are still here. Not much of soul since the last time, and we did get some new green lights, I think. Maybe some new matchbox, but I'm not seeing a chase anywhere. Um, no green lights, no Johnny Lightnings. I don't see that. There you go. But they did get some in case it looks like, so we're gonna look through that and I'll let you guys know if I find anything. Alrighty, so out of all the pegs, uh, we were only able to find one cosmic. But that was it, so I'll see you guys at the next store. Alrighty, so this aisle, well, I'm at a Walmart right now, and they got a case of. It seems to be Johnny Lightnings or Auto Worlds. But these have been here since last week. So, nothing new there. And here are the Auto Worlds right there. And of course, a few are missing. <laughs> a bit late to this party, but whatever, you know. I'll try again tomorrow, but it's two missing. It's not the end of the world, but. It's whatever, but that's it for this store. Um, I'll see you guys tomorrow when I hit the um, other store, so see you then. Alright, this is what the aisles are looking like to me. Uh, pretty empty at this store, but they did get some on the pegs, but nothing on there. And they got some M2s down there, but all duds all look through already, as you guys can see. They got some green lights, all the woods, all that, but nothing so moving on to the next door year later it was like this full yesterday huh it was like this yesterday it was okay no it's not even worth looking through because what they did they did this yeah all right, everyone, so that is the end of this week's hunt, but now we're on to the best segment of the video, showing you what we got this week. So for starters, um, yesterday, I actually went to a Target, and they put out two cases of E-Case, but treasure hunt, and everything was gone, and it's the, that Target is very, like, um, very weird, because there's a few employees that actually take things. And put them aside for other people so i was just happy i was able to get a godzilla so that was neat and then i also traded for this nissan silva team transport very cool as you can see there very cool and then last but not least i actually bought a mazda cosmos for treasure hunt or no super plus the treasure hunt and that will be going with our super collection this year as you guys can see there so it's very neat and this morning we actually did go to a walmart um when they opened and i actually managed to open an m2 case but there's another collector there so um if you guys know me i don't bother filming when other collectors are around but i opened it it was a dud case uh it was the nhra 124 scales but it was whatever but that was pretty neat and then i went to a target this morning but there was of course another collector there so i didn't bother but I also wanted to showcase you guys, since we have more time in today's video, my whole collection. So I actually have two bins of stuff, and I might as well just show you guys. So, um, In these boxes here, I traded for these this week too. They're the um, RWEB Silhouette Porsches. So I actually traded for four of them, those um, um, Liberty Box Silhouettes. Uh, I actually traded for four of those for four of these. So that was pretty neat to get these. Alright, so then I also bought two smaller boxes. One of them has a Godzilla that um, I'm actually going to be trade or someone's buying it off me. And then I have this piece right here, the Los Angeles Convention Willie. And if you're wondering why I have stickers on them, we actually, um, here where I live in Vegas, we actually have a meetup where, you know, collectors in the area come up. You can sell items you know trade it for other items that you may want that someone else may want this for so it's really neat so that's pretty much what i do if i see something i want or see something find a chase you know i buy it in hopes of trading and i also have a muscle machine chase 
And I also don't go really off eBay values. I kind of keep it low. I'm not trying to overprice. I have a green light chase here. Black Stallion. Found it at Hobby Lobby. And these prices, of course, aren't final. You know, negotiations. I'm not trying to rip people of their money. We got Thelma and Luis Chase too. Green bottom. And then the Kings of Crunch. Walmart Chase. So this is just a placeholder price. This isn't the actual one I have for it, but um, I actually have it for 20. This is kind of just what I had it when I first found it, but and then I also have this cool Auto World Dodge Challenger, so that's also pretty neat. I'm pretty sure that's it in there. And then all of these are actually all the supers I have. So I actually have two um, supers from last year: the Audi and the purple Mustang. I actually traded someone this for a convention piece at the last meetup we had, so that was pretty very neat. And then I also have this Dodge Challenger super, so that's also really neat and then the two of my highest valued ones i have the short card um sesto elemental super so that was very neat um this is kind of just what i see them on ebay right now selling for 200 so it's kind of a um, placeholder i'm kind of looking to trade someone for this i don't really want to you know have them buy it i'm really looking to trade and then i also managed to get the factory sealed nissan um super also trying to trade for this. I don't want someone to buy it. I'm really trying to find something I want to trade for that. And then I also have a Nissan Fairlady Super in there, as well as a Matchbox Super Chase Bronco. A uh, Johnny Lightning two pack in there. Golf um, Volkswagen. And then we have that Chase that we found last week in here too. You see that 750. And I actually found no listings of it on eBay, like, um, being sold. But there are listings, and this is the closest I got to it. So, it's another one I'm looking to trade for. But I don't really want to um, <laughs> deprive people of their money. So, just looking to trade. And then, um, in here, these are all my premiums I actually have. Um, I mostly just have, you know, Fast and Furious ones, Drag Strip Demons, and Mountain Drifters. And some Ronin Runs. That's pretty much it for that bin, though. So... And then moving on over here, I actually got to grab some of the M2 cartons. And then I have that um, Fun Lines 510 Dotson too. So that was neat. And then I also have this Model Kit Chase. And I have another display. And I also have this thing too, the NHRA. And then I actually have the Raw with it. See there. And that's pretty neat. And then here I have most of the M2 ornaments from last year. The only one I wasn't able to get was a Silverado, but it was kind of kind of whatever. And then all these, these are literally all just main lines. Either the Max main lines, treasure hunts. Not anything too special. But kind of just have these there. Just whatever. I have them for two bucks. Not trying to prive. Most people at the meets have them for like five bucks. It's ridiculous. But that's pretty much it. Pretty much my collection. And then I have, of course, you have this super set. And I have a few pops up there. That's my most prized one right there, the autograph. But yeah, that's pretty much it. Thank you guys for watching this week's hunt. And I hope you enjoyed. Leave a like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys next week.